see as Derek Anderson comes into the game at quarterback for the AFC first and 10 from the 34 yard line. Anderson to the tight end Gonzalez. Moments ago, Tony Saragusa chatted with the AFC quarterback, Derek Anderson. All right, I'm here with Derek Anderson. Derek, you're going in, man. Uh, any, any butterflies or anything like that? What are you looking forward to? Uh, going out there and make a few plays, you know. Go out there and have fun with it and uh, get, get my guys the ball and let them do what they do. You know, there's defensive guys, man. They're going to come at you. They're going to bring maybe the heat. I heard them talking maybe about a blitz. Any nerves? Any nerves? All right. You ready to go? Yeah. All right, man. Good luck. Thanks, man. Rule changes from the regular season. And it's a 15 yard unsportsmanlike conduct penalty. First and 10 from the 40. Anderson complete to Reggie Wayne. Picks up an AFC first down. You could get into a situation where anytime they blitz, they are going to have an impact on the play. Anderson swings it out to Neal. And Neal is tackled by Ian. They've kind of met for the first time, you know, over here this week and have, have met at fences also. Pass caught by Braylon Edwards, and Gerard said yesterday we've been... Uh, you know, it, it was a completely different style of helmet. I wore a bike helmet. Brett had a Rydell. It didn't quite fit that well. Uh, the face mask was different. I didn't have the center bar that went all the way to the top. I had an open... Packers to a franchise record 13-win season. Anderson on second and ten, caught by McGahee, and he's tackled from behind by Greg Ellis. Maybe has a group bigger than that. You know, they, they, can, they can come out a little bit behind if they lose this game. On fourth and eight, Anderson complete for a first down to Gonzalez. Here for your first Pro Bowl, you go to check out, and, and somehow that balance isn't quite what you thought it was. Anderson incomplete. He was looking for Chad Johnson. Derek Anderson wanted six Cleveland Browns here today. The last time the Browns sent six players to the Pro Bowl, Bill Belichick was their head coach back in 1994. Well, it just goes to show that with team success come individual honors. And the Cleveland Browns, you know, in the playoff hunt down the stretch, got, uh, got beat out by Tennessee the final week of the season. But uh, we, we've got six guys from the Cleveland Browns here today. So, you know, congratulations to Romeo Cornell on an extension uh, with his head coaching contract. You know, keep some consistency there. You've got a very, very competitive young team ready to take that next step. Having a big day in front of his guys on top of that. Anderson complete to Winslow. The executive producers of Fox Sports are Ed Gorin and David Hill. Dave Corris crunching the numbers. Ben Palmer, our spotter, as the catch is made for a first down by Reggie Wayne. I think North Turner was impressed by uh, by several of the Cleveland Browns this year. We, we mentioned what his uh, his impressions of Raylan Edwards, but he remembers Derek Anderson at the combine, and he said in his workout, if you just went, you know, took away all the uh, all the other things and just look, you know, who's the best passer out there, who looks the best, he, he said it was Derek Anderson in his class. Hey, double right, skip right. 588 nod, F track swinger. And North's son was a graduate assistant at Oregon State, Derek Anderson's alma mater. <coughs> so North had a connection to the program. Derek Anderson, a sixth round draft pick by the Ravens. Back in 2005, he was released and picked up by the Cleveland Browns. Led them to a 10 win season, 7 0 at home. Anderson in trouble, down he goes. But he's uh, he's playing some of his old position defensive end right now. Second down and 21. The screen to Willis McGahee. And McGahee is tackled by Demarcus Ware.